This mysterious player took control of the Dragon Egg, Strength SMP's most valuable item, and he's forcing everyone to compete in various challenges that could make you betray your teammates, your alliances, and give up one of the most important things on the server. But let's run it back a bit. A player that goes by the name Vadov killed my teammate Pantra three times and stole the Dragon Egg, and gave me my first challenge to retrieve it back. Your first assignment is simple. You have 24 hours to kill a teammate under any means necessary. You must record yourself killing this teammate. Everyone who passes will move on to the next round and will be able to further compete for the Dragon Egg. The first challenge is to murder one of my teammates or else I can't move on to the next round. But he didn't say I couldn't fake it. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna flee. <laughs> with the first task done, I kept wondering what his true motives were with these challenges, or if he was even planning to give the dragon egg to anybody. But I put these thoughts aside as day two rolled around. A new task came out with it. Your next assignment is to get an additional strength under any means necessary. This can be done by killing, trading, betraying, etc. We had to place the strength 1,000 blocks away from spawn. Getting it in the first place would be no easy task. You see, on this server, every time you die, you lose minus one attack damage. But when you get a kill, you gain plus one attack damage, meaning I would have to kill someone or give up one of my own strength. Unfortunately, I didn't have a choice. All right, so as of right now, I, I, I can't kill anyone. Before this stupid event ends, I'm just gonna give one of my own strength. This really sucks, but this is what I have to do. <laughs> so that's with draw one. Being left at plus two instead of plus three wouldn't be a huge difference, but let's hope it doesn't throw me under the bus. The next objective is to make a lava cast 1,000 to 2,000 blocks away from spawn. No more, no less. This is a questionable task, but I want the dragon egg, so who really cares? I need the materials to make the lava cast in the first place, but those won't be hard to get. All right, guys, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go and finish up this challenge because I have the blocks that I need. It doesn't say it has to be too big. I do need to go rather far away, so let's just do that really quickly. There we go. Alright, and there we go. Challenge is done. Third challenge, done. After doing this, I sat back at my base and waited for the next challenge to come along. The next day, Vadov set up a series of 1v1s to compete directly for the Dragon Egg. With everyone fighting, I was put up against Ultra. I'm, I'm, I'm seeing enough, so I'm sticking here. I'm sticking here. Yeah, but no one kills me, please. I'm on. Who would win? Play v bro. bruh. <laughs> we should we should we should build the walls up next round. Let's build the walls up next round in case. The one that it's not ultra, bro. What? Just what Venom Dev said. Okay, that's what's up a chest over there for my loot. If anyone steals it, I got read. I think no, he doesn't. He's not going to carry. He's not going to lose. I mean, I'll try. I'll try my best. We don't lose, we just make it faster for all of us. Oh, nice. nice! The fight was over, but I had one more fight afterwards that could lead to my downfall. You see, one of the rules were that you can't restock after one of your fights, so I was left on low materials and armor durability. The chances I do win my next fight are extremely low, but I gave it my all. I lost my fight, and a player named Frey MC won the egg, but I couldn't help but wonder, who is Vado, the man who conjured this entire thought out series of challenges? Who is he? It was my own teammate Pantro, someone I've only recently started trusting, but he gave me something. Uh, there's there's two items that I want to give to Nufuli, if he'll come up here real quick. Oh? I want you to each chest the items I'm about to give you. These two things I'm about to give you are, I mean, they're not really valuable, but like they're symbolic. The first thing, see. the remains of the armor trims from the blue armor era. Wait, yeah. <laughs> the blue armor era? Wow. That's crazy. Yeah, there's only, there's oh only 26 God. left and I want you to have them. There's one more thing. This yeah. item I've had since the very start of the server. Uh, pretty sure I got it day one. The first item that we got and cherished basically was this. I, I want you to keep it. For oh me. my gosh. <laughs> Apparently, he was leaving the server and wanted me to have this as his last wish. I love you, Pantro. We all do.